In the eastern state of Odisha, a transformative movement is underway. It's a story of empowerment, collective prosperity and good governance. The story of community participation, a partnership that's changing the face of urban development in the state. The government of Odisha has recognized the power of community participation in addressing state capacity gaps, reducing corruption and promoting transparency. Through initiatives like the Jaga Mission, the Mukhya Mantri Karma Tatpar Abhiyan, otherwise known as the Mukta Scheme, Fecal Sludge and Septage Management and Solid Waste Management, the state is shifting the focus from contractors to communities. This purposeful transition is driven by a gender-intentional approach, ensuring that the needs of all are taken into account. At the heart of this approach lie the three core tenets – decentralization, community leadership and inclusivity. By making communities partners and co-creators of assets, Odisha is ensuring that the voices of communities are heard and their needs are met. This approach has been cemented in the urban development context through crucial amendments to the Odisha Municipal Act of 1950 and the Odisha Municipal Corporation Act of 2003, mandating city governments to adopt community participation as a core principle. What does this mean for the most vulnerable members of society, women and transgender individuals? For them, Community participation has a profoundly empowering impact. Financial inclusion is a critical aspect of this empowerment. Through initiatives like Mukta, they are gaining access to financial services, training and resources, enabling them to take control of their economic lives. They are breaking free from the cycle of poverty and dependence. And instead, they are saving investing and planning for the future. We are working here for two years here and in the community, as before, we didn't get so much facilities in the society. So, we were in the begging or sex work profession. We were in a group of 10 women and we were in that group. And when we talked about the government, we were given the work to give the government. So, today, I and my sister are transgenders, trans men, community brothers, we are working here and we are working here with a lot of dignity. Today, we are working here with a lot of dignity and with a lot of dignity. We are working here with a lot of dignity and with a lot of dignity. किसी के पास हाथ फैलाने के लिए नहीं पड़ता है ये संभव हुआ है हमारे राज्य सरकार के वजह से ऑटोनोमी एंड एजेंसी आर ऑल्सो एसेंशियल कॉम्पोनेंट ऑफ दिस एम्पावरमेंट थ्रू कम्युनिटी पार्टिसिपेशन दे आर एबल टू मेक डिसीजन दैट अफेक्ट देर ओन लाइफ एंड कम्युनिटीज शेपिंग देर ओन डेस्टिनीज टू एनहेंस देर केपेबिलिटीज द गवर्नमेंट प्रोवाइड इम्प्लीमेंटेशन गाइडलाइंस स्टैंडर्ड ऑपरेटिंग प्रोसीजर्स टेम्पलेट्स and technology platforms to support their technical and managerial skill requirements. Formal contracts with community groups give legal validity to these partnerships, recognizing them as integral to development and governance. Capacity building programs are being implemented to improve the abilities of SDA and members of our self-help groups. Efforts are also being made to bridge the trust deficit between the government and the community through behavioral change initiatives such as team building exercises. Initiatives like Jug Mission help SDAs open bank accounts and funds are being transferred from city governments to these accounts, ensuring SDAs have the resources they need to drive positive change in their communities. Community participation is restoring dignity and identity to women and transgender individuals. They are able to assert their identities, express themselves freely and demand respect and recognition from their communities. Initiatives like Jagasampark, which organize awards and events with and for them, are helping to achieve this. The members engaged are given uniforms and ID cards creating a sense of job identity and purpose. In Odisha, community participation is more than just a buzzword. It's a beacon of hope for a more inclusive and equitable future. It's a story that shows us that even the most marginalized and vulnerable can become agents of change.
shaping their own destinies and contributing to the development of their communities.